Hi guys, another pleasant good morning to you. Welcome to TransWest Truck Trailer RV here in beautiful Frederick, Colorado. Um, today is a beautiful day, sun is out, and we got a beautiful truck behind us. It's a 2019 Ram 1500 Big Horn. This one is the basic version. Like for all those out there looking for a simple truck, looking for something just to go to work and back, or just a simple, a simple family truck too. This actually sits six people, which is amazing. Uh, most pickups uh, sit five, um, but this big one behind me does have an extra seat. Um, and to go over like some of the uh, the different levels or trim levels on the Ram 1500, um, a, a few of you guys are familiar with the Rams and know the different uh, trim levels. Um, we'll start off with the Tradesman. Um, the Big Horn kind of sits right next to the Tradesman. Um, you have the Rebel, you have the Laramie, the Laramie Longhorn, and the Limited. And come 2021, this year, Ram introduced the new TRX off-road uh, model. Um, this version has so much exclusive um, features it's just it's just top of the line um, but today we're going to talk about this 2019 uh, Ram 1500 just above 15,000 miles um, still have still have tons of warranty left on it like I said it's a simple basic truck um, we could take a look around this truck right now as you guys can see exterior um, is white um, you can see on the hood right now, it shows you that 1500. It shows you the type of engine it has on it as well, which is kind of amazing. Um, it shows you the Hemi 5.7 liter engine. Stock number on this unit here will be 5U201046. You guys could go online to our transwest.com. Um, you could actually search right here on the, the stock number and you guys would see a bunch of pictures of that unit even the price of that unit as well. I want to take a look at the tires first. Um, here we got the uh, Goodyear tires. It's 275, 65 R18s. Tons of life on this, on this, on those tires, both front and back. You guys can see the two-tone interior. You have the black with the tan. And of course, you got those black interior seating as well. All cloth interior seats. As you guys could see, the bench seat, well, it's not a bench seat in front, but you have that um, three sitting in the front, driver and two passengers. Also in the back, you guys will see the bench seat here for an additional three passengers, which makes it a six passenger vehicle. And if you fold those seats, Gives you tons of floor room here, so if you don't want to store things in the back of your the bed of the truck, you have extra um, storage in the back of the truck. So um, tons of uh, floor room here. Underneath those mats, you got tons of storage on both sides. Gives you a little toolbox here or whatever you want to put inside here, personal items, and of course just cover that with your your mats. Um, so tons of leg room. Tons of added seating, so just such a beautiful truck. Like I said, a lot of people don't like a lot of things in that truck for, for it being a work truck, or if somebody just wants something simple that and, and affordable, they will go for a truck like this. It will do the job as any other truck. We did add Rhino line into the back of this truck. And of course, you guys know um, having the Rhino line in instead of the, uh, the normal plastic they have to cover this um, no water will be left underneath this and you know cause rust underneath the the plastic that normally comes on those trucks with the rhino line in um, it saves you all the rust um, actually helps with uh, scratches and stuff like that on the back of the bed um, and this gives it a clean look as well so this will last you a very very long time um, and you'll hardly see any wear and tear on this unless if something actually dig into it, but that could be easily uh, fixed. This one does come with a backup camera. And it does come pre-hookup with, um, for 
pull in a trailer um, so you have your four pin and seven pin hook up here all you got to do is just add a ball um, to the hitch here to the bumper um, we have those screw on balls um, in our parts department we could actually add one on to that truck um, and you could tow a maximum of about 11,000 pounds so uh, dual exhaust system chrome bumper coming around like I tell you guys those tires are super like it has a tons of life left on it tons of tread um, it's only a 19 with less than just above 15,000 miles so you guys will be ready to go back seat on the other view like I said we have storage boxes on either side of this unit so you guys can put personal items here as well let's take a look at the engine here I did mention to you guys it is the fifth um, the Hemi 5.7 liter V8 Hemi um, it is partnered with an 8-speed automatic transmission produces about 395 horsepower and about 410 pound-foot of torque MPG gas mileage on the, on this unit is about 5 in the city 21 on the highway so it is it is a truck so you guys could understand the gas mileage on this and it is a pipe a 5.7 liter engine clean engine service has been done safety checks has been done so this truck is ready and set to go so you don't have to worry about services once you buy this truck um, all alls and everything has been changed and all safety check brakes and everything has been checked so clean carfax as well so we could produce one of that for you guys as well so you guys know um, and of course like i said tons of warranty left on it still so we could go ahead and tell you exactly um, what amount of warranty is left on this truck so let's take a quick look inside like i said it is a basic truck so there's not much to it very simple um, mileage on this right now as we speak is 15,610 miles and I like to go exactly um, on mileage, you know, just to show you guys, um, you know, mileage on this unit as of the video. So you guys know what you're getting yourself into directly after this video. So 15,610 miles on this unit. Super basic, as you guys can see, the way the dashboard is laid out. Um, super basic, not too much buttons to get confused with. Um, first of all, um, it is a push to start. So keys could be on your person and all you got to do put your foot on the brake and then push that um, start engine button so I'm gonna just kind of use my hand on the brake and push this oh well, the fob is too far away let me just bring it closer all you got to do is just touch that push and you're good to go um, your controls here uh, to get to reverse neutral and drive is just for this uh, circle here um, you do have four auto so you could put it in all-wheel drive or you could have four four wheel high four wheel low or you could put it in two-wheel drive as well um, so you have uh, four different options here all your AC controls right here um, down here you have your traction control and your haul button so very simple um, on your steering wheel you have your hands free calling on your left hand side on your right you have your cruise control just behind the steering wheel here on the right side is your volume control so when you're driving you don't have to go straight to your stereo to turn the volume up you could just leave your hand on the steering wheel concentrate on the road and adjust the volume as needed on the left side you have your your track uh, controls here so you could actually change the radio stations change the different tracks on your Bluetooth device if you play music directly from your phone or if you um, listening to satellite radio or FM AM radio you could actually change the station directly um, behind this here as well um, on the left side here I mean we are a little bit far away but right as soon as you open the door you'll see your light controls here I normally leave it on auto because it makes it easier so at night you don't forget to turn your lights on or off it will come on automatically um, it does have a light for your for your um, the bed of the truck you could turn that on um, and turn it off as well um, you could actually there's a dim control here that actually dims 
um, all the lights on your dash so if it's too bright in your eyes you could actually um, lower the, the brightness on, on the dash as well um, tons of storage we got storage unit right here you could actually put your personal items in here coins um, money wallet phone right next to it here we have um, your USB controls and auxiliary plugs so you have your USB or phantom or um, auxiliary plug here you got two uh, of those USB ports here underneath the seat has a little storage box here as well for personal items two cup holders and a little tray here in your glove compartment and of course you got a little storage shelf here as well um, this vehicle does come equipped with a rear window but it is manually operated um, so you have to actually go back there and open it up this middle seat does fall down and then you have a hand rest with two cup holders and of course storage unit underneath here as well it does come equipped with a usb port in here as well so you have multiple usb charging ports as you guys can see multiple cup holders you do have cup holders in the doors as well um, this unit is priced right guys like i said it's a 2019 ram 1500 big horn um, this is the big horn version that is the basic i did do a comparison with you guys with the two big horns we have on the lot right now we have the other one that does have more features in terms of um, you have the heated steering wheel you have heated seats this one doesn't come with heated seats but it, it, it does, you know, heat up really quick. Um, but you have the uh, Apple Play on the, uh, on, on the other one, but this one does have a backup camera. It does come with uh, hands-free calling. It does come with Bluetooth technology as well. So um, you will be getting a good truck with everything that basic you're looking for. So give us a call today. Um, it's yours truly, don't hesitate. Call me anytime at 303. 684 3412. Text or call me on my cell at 661 755 4344. Or you could email me on the bottom here at marlin.bledman at transwest.com. And you guys could also look me up on, on social media at Mr. Haller on Facebook. Um, just starting off this page, trying to you know put our inventory out there and kind of chat with you guys one on one. So, um, Thank you guys for tuning in today. Friday again, I'll be here with another video with you guys. This time I'll bring out one of our big boys, one of our freight liners as well. Um, and we'll go over some of the questions you guys have on that unit. So um, feel free to contact me at any time. Marlon Bledman is my name. Thank you guys for tuning in and we'll see you on Friday. Thank you.